Hello guys and welcome! Now, let's say you just created your first Minecraft server by watching the previous video, hopefully. As you can see you have now a working server, but what do you do with that? Nobody can connect to it. You see that nobody is in there. What IP address do you give your friends? Well, you could use a technique called port forwarding, which I briefly explained in the last video, but for most people, especially beginners, it can be difficult and scary at first times. So what I'm gonna teach you today is how to use this completely free tool called Angrok. Now, in order to get it set up and running, just open the first link in the description and you will be taken to this page to angrok.com. In here, please sign up uh, for a free account. This is going to be forever and will allow you to have one full connection to your server. After you signed up, please go to the download page, just like so, and click here in the download zip file for Windows 64 bit. Once you installed Angrok like that, you will have a .exe file. Like for example the one that I just have right here, angrok.exe. Now in order to actually use the thing, you need to type in cmd to get the command prompt up and running, then type in cd desktop just like I did. I'm going to have all these commands highlighted on the screen for you to see them better. Then once you're in the desktop, oh sorry. Uh, where you go here depends on where you put the .exe folder, so you need to make sure you are in the same folder as your angrok.exe file. Now, once you did that, go to your account page by logging in again. I'm gonna blur here everything because um, this is quite personal. Here you can see the two tab that says connect to your account. In here, down here, it will be now blurred, but there will be a command that says angrok space config space add auth token and then your personal token for your account. Now, what I want you to do is to copy the whole thing, like I'm just doing here, copy it all, and then go to the command prompt that you opened earlier that is in the same directory as your file and paste that command and hit enter. Okay guys, I'm back. Uh, I just discovered that I have my Angrok instance, the working one, in another folder, so here I am again. So as I was saying, paste your command with your old token and hit enter. Now as you can see, um, it gives an error to me, unrecognized command config. Now this should not happen to you because you will download the latest version of Engrok. Now if this happens, you can just type auth token and then paste the token directly. I don't know if you understood that, I hope you did. Now once you're in here, let's now connect to the server, so just type in this command and guys, I had a little bit of difficulties in on the technical side, so as we're saying, just now that we're here, type ngrok tcp uh, dash region, uh, sorry not dash, region eu, and then the port that Minecraft uses. Now if you did not change that in the server configuration file, it normally is 25565. Now if you did change that, you can see that I'm going to show you, just give me a minute because I am sure that it will tell you here. Look here, starting Minecraft server on 25565. Just make sure these two numbers match. Once you did that, hit enter. Now as you can see here, you can see session styles online. You can see your name on the account, your plan is the free one. And what you have to give your friends is this IP. Everything that is highlighted here you have to give them. 
and they will type in this IP on their Minecraft client to access your server. Now this works as long as this window remains open, so never close that. If you close this and then do the same command, the IP will change and you will have to give to them again. So thank you for watching, if you have any questions please write it down in the comments and we'll see us next time.